Working for Penn State, I'm used to growlers. But when we found out there was a growler up here in Lock Haven, we figured we'd better check it out. Thank you. The growler basically is a hot dog with uh, mustard, onion, chili sauce. And I think the name originated from the college in the 60s. Apparently, the original owners called one of these things a Texas hot dog. And years ago, when customers would come in and refer to it as the growler, they would actually charge them an extra quarter because they thought it was a put down. These days, under either name, lots of people enjoy them. What's good about the growler is it tastes good and it's affordable. It's just a quick lunch. The Texas has always been here, so it's kind of one of those things you just have to eat. I have nephews that come from North Carolina, and they have to come here and get their growler. <laughs> they love it. We take up a whole bar. The family comes, the whole family. We'll just sit around in one bar. You know. Some of the customers say that they been to other, you know, hot dog shops and stuff, and say that there's nothing like our sauce. Like our sauce is different from everyone else's. So nothing's like the Texas, I guess. Every time we do one of these segments, I try my best to do a complete research job so I can give you the proper information. So this time, you get to watch me do it. Delicious. Mm. Everyone loves the growler in Lock Haven in Clinton County, but you better know how to order one. Are these everything Gloria? If they come in and just order a hot dog, they know it's mustard onion sauce. That's basically what we do unless you say something different. So a lot of out-of-towners will come in and order a hot dog, they get mustard onion sauce. And they enjoy them then, they end up ordering a second one. A lot of the cooking is done by Phil and his mom. And on any given day, you can see them with the customers, some of which come in several times a day. Even the governor has stopped by. During the campaign, he had made the stop here, and he came in and got, they parked the Rendell bus out front, and they got, uh, here they come now. They got, uh, thank you so much. Eight growlers uh, to go and sat on the, out on the bus and ate them. And then I'd like to continue talking to you guys, but I have my growlers now, and it's lunchtime, so if you just leave me alone, uh, I'll eat. Okay, I've had a growler. It's a great hot dog and everything, but it still isn't clear to me why they call it the growler. A copy of the program you've just seen can be purchased through Penn State Media Sales at mediasales.psu.edu or by calling 800-770-2111.